so let's uh, now discuss about aerospace department in iit madras and you are doing ms in that so first i start with your uh, brief uh, introduction i mean uh, your name which uh, br uh, specific course you are in uh, aerospace and your graduation what is the uh, your graduation in uh, what uh, domain you have done your graduation so we start from there and then we discuss about the aerospace department of iit madras uh, so my name is gopesh krishna yadav and i have done my btech in mechatronics engineering from triple it bhagalpur in uh, 2022 okay and uh, i joined in uh, july 2022 uh, in uh, ms aerospace engineering in uh, uh, iit madras okay in uh, uh, flight mechanics and uh, control uh, domain uh, which is actually uh, part of a specialization uh, aerodynamics uh, flight mechanics and control and uh, aircraft design okay so you have done your graduation in mechatronics so after mechatronics what are the typical opportunities and options for higher education available for you uh, for higher education uh, in india if i want to say then i have to go for mechatronics only go for uh, gate ha uh, no after gate, in, gate what are the courses in which you can go uh, courses uh, i can go in uh, any courses if i want uh, robotics okay let me ask you uh, mechatronics i have seen like iit patna has mechatronics some more iits have mechatronics you can also go for mechanical engineering may design kind of departments yeah you are eligible for that i have to give, give a gate mechanical for that and i have also give, given gate a mechanical in that okay. so i can go in um, design i can go in thermal i can go in uh, manufacturing i mm -hmm. have a huge uh, lot of lot of opportunities okay so now now let me ask you when we talk about aerospace department of iit madras please tell me what are the different uh, you know specializations in this particular department of iit madras uh, so different place specializations are uh, uh, propulsion structures aerodynamics flight mechanics and control and uh, aircraft design okay so you uh, can you also tell me like these specializations are taken by what branch of students because as for my understanding aerospace is interdisciplinary department so let's say civil engineer what specialization he should go for electronic engineer what specialization he should go for mechanical which specialization he should go for and mechatronics so can you tell me which branch graduation and they should go in which specialization uh, for example if i am talking about propulsion uh, mechanical engineer can go there uh, chemical engineering engineer people can go also there mm -hmm. and if i am talking about structures then a uh, mechanical engineer uh, civil engineer can do, go there mm -hmm. and also i can say mechatronics engineer also can go there mm. because of design perspective okay and uh, if i am talking about uh, particular about uh, particularly about electronics and communication and electrical uh, branch people mm -hmm. then they uh, best option for them is uh, flight mechanics and control which mm -hmm. is in a uh, aircraft uh, uh, design uh, aerodynamics and flight mechanics and control uh, specialization mm -hmm. so they can uh, go in that uh, domain okay so now can you also tell me what is uh, flight mechanics and control what is this all about in briefly if you can tell me uh, flight mechanics and control is about uh, uh, dynamics uh, of uh, aircraft and uh, control algorithms which are applied on the uh, aircraft to uh, make it a stay make a stable flight or a maneuverable flight okay so uh, what kind of branches student can join this particular course uh, mechanical engineers can, can join, join okay uh, mm -hmm. electric electrical engineer can join mm -hmm. electronics and communication can join mm -hmm. and mechatronics and uh, other uh, instrumentation people also can join can join and i think uh, computer science can also join mm -hmm. okay now can you tell me what uh, what are the placement opportunities in your department in my department uh, so talking about uh, placement opportunities uh, so uh, like uh, for uh, if i talk about my specialization flight mechanics and control so one of my senior got placed in a uh, honda r&d mm. uh, it is a japan based uh, placement mm. uh, and uh, it has it is very good uh, uh, it has a very good package of 54 uh, lakh lpa mm -hmm. and uh, in structures uh, Uh, there are uh, placement related to uh, specifically uh, specifically uh, design uh, design uh, part of uh, mm. uh, in design industry mm -hmm. and for propulsion there is uh, like companies like ge mm -hmm. general electric or uh, mm. collins air aerospace mm -hmm. these companies uh, come for uh, placement and uh, also airbus uh, comes for placement mm -hmm. and apart from uh, core uh, uh, there are placements in non core i have uh, met some seniors which mm -hmm. are placed in uh, non core companies mm -hmm. uh, of uh, data analytics and mm -hmm. data science mm -hmm. so there are a lot uh, of uh, opportunities uh, for placement in aerospace uh, department wonderful so do you want to say anything to the students who aspire to win aerospace department of it madras 
yeah if you want to fly if uh, your dream is to fly like my dream was to fly <laughs> so you should choose a aerospace, aerospace department. department okay for making such systems uh, which can fly okay thanks a lot for your entire input and very sure it will help the students thank you okay sir thank you sir